We've been led to believe that imposter syndrome is a negative thing, and we've seen it hold back so many would-be entrepreneurs from amazing success and from leaving impact on the lives of so many others. But is imposter syndrome really a negative thing? I'm saying that I'm an imposter. My name is James Patrick. Now, what do I mean by being an imposter? I had no idea how to be a photographer until I started taking photos. And then I built a career where I photographed more than 500 magazine covers. I had no idea how to write a book until I sat down to figure it out and I wrote a book that became a bestseller. I had no idea how to host events until I crafted a conference that sold out five years in a row. And I absolutely had no idea how to host a podcast until I sat in front of a microphone, I started recording, I released that podcast, which is now charting in more than a dozen countries. Stop seeing imposter syndrome as a negative thing. Being an imposter is a great thing. Being an imposter means that I'm figuring it out, that I'm willing to be accountable, that I'm saying this is who I am, this is what I do, this is why it matters, and it's okay that if I don't know all the answers yet. This is what we all go through to get to where we want to go. So say it with me. I'm an imposter and that just means I'm figuring it out.